Let's fill up their pan. Becky Colano and her son Bennett feed some of their chickens that are now in high demand for the eggs they produce. When the stay-at-home order first went into place, I, there was a mad rush on eggs. I, I couldn't keep them in stock and I was selling out within hours. It was pretty crazy. And it's not only farm fresh eggs that are wanted. Some are asking about how to have their own chicken ranch. I have waiting lists now for chicks and they're selling out within the day. And after speaking with the would-be egg farmers, she thinks the run on chickens is more about getting back to basics than wanting a ready egg supply. A lot of people now that they're spending so much time at home and time with their kids are wanting to actually do some more homesteading type things, raising their own type of food. There they are. Hi ladies. And someone else who has seen the demand for her eggs increase is Tara Coronado of Walnut Grove, who sells hers locally. I definitely have noticed like the increase of people asking for eggs. I get a lot more texts and phone calls asking if I have extra eggs this week. She lives on a farm and she understands why some would like to raise their own chickens, but she cautions. But it's just like raising a dog. Like you have to know what you're doing. You can't just shove them in the backyard and like expect to get eggs, you know? Tara says a chick takes six to nine months before we'll lay an egg, so patience is called for, and she's willing to help people get started. I'm trying to help people be responsible chicken owners. <laughs> and if you do your homework and raise your own chickens, Tara says you will be rewarded. They're so good, and it's like any food, I think. Like, <laughs> you just don't realize how good homegrown food is until you do it. In Walnut Grove, Will Hereford, KCRA 3 News.